Hi everyone, so let's talk about the ESX modules. So like uh, in our application, we will be having the modules stored in the different files. Okay. So it can be either one module per file or uh, one file having a multiple modules. Okay. So one module can import uh, things from another modules. This is called exporting and exporting, importing. From one file, you are exporting the modules and then in another file, you are importing those modules. So let's talk about how we can do uh, the export and import of the modules when working with the different files. So there are two different kind of exports. One is a named export and another is a default export. So named export and default export, what is the difference here? So like this is our lib.js. Inside the lib.js, we are having these all different functions and one is a constant. So this file is having the multiple functions. Okay. So this is a named, a named export. You are exporting this function, you are exporting this, exporting this. Okay. So this particular file is exporting a lot of stuff out of it. So when we need to import, either we can select that I want to import only square and diag only from this, or I want to import only square out of it. Okay. So this is called a named export where you can select that I want to import only this. So uh, the named import, named export, several per modules. Whenever you have a multiple things in a file, you can you can export them and here we are importing them imports asterisk as a lib so what i'm doing here i'm importing them everything from that module lib as an alias lib so i will be accessing the methods using lib.square lib.diag so default export is uh, the default export is whenever, whenever you have a single entity or a single function in your file or a single class in your uh, file then that is called as a default export because you have only a single value to be to be exported from that file so like some, something like this this is a function which is only a single function in the file so you can put it export default and no need to put a name it is like a alias function anonymous function which can be imported with some name import xyz from this so this xyz will represent this function similarly that is our same for the classes export default class and we are importing this class as a this is anonymous class import class name from this class and this class is representing this particular class this variable so we can create an instance of that class so this is about import and export you can do export either a default export if you have a single entity single function single class otherwise you need to use a named export and using while using the import you need to you can specify either you want to import this and this x and y or you want to import this as a whole import star as an alias from lib so that's all about import export and esx module thanks everyone